Okay, welcome back everyone that might be watching this. This is episode 33 uh, with Red Dead Redemption 2. Probably the greatest game ever made. Or so far at least. Um, I hope there will be Red Dead Redemption 3. You never know. But that would be awesome. That would be so, 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 so appreciated from, from my side. Uh, and The Last of Us 2. No, The Last of Us 3. Yeah, The Last of Us 3. That would be great as well. Then I can continue this series. Uh, comfy slippers on. Comfy sweater. And a cup of hot coffee. Not so hot anymore. That's cool. And for to get some fibers into my body. And oh, this looks kind of nasty now. This is a piece of apple. So this is actually apple from my garden uh, out front. I have a tiny, tiny, tiny sliver piece of a garden. Uh, and on that yard there is an apple tree and it produces very delicious apples actually so many people come to ask if they can pick my apples and most of them can do if they're nice kind people who like to chill and play games <laughs> no but it's good to have some fibers. So, this was kind of scary. Where I'm outside of Shady Bell, but okay. They just threw me out there. Oh, let's bump. wait a minute. I need to look at this. What the hell is this? Rustling Uncle. Uh, should I do that? Rustling with uncle. Let's try that. I'm not very good at taming wild horses, but hey, I could give it a try. And rustling doesn't seem like a hobby for uncle. Go rustling. Oh, don't be like that. This is a good one. Yeah, it always is with you. Until we start getting shot at. Well, have you ever been shot at by a cow? Whose cows? This drunken rancher up at Hill Haven Ranch. He's such a flop that we could take a whole marching band up there and steal, and he still wouldn't wake up. And he's a son of a bitch. He said unkind things about me. <laughs> mm, yeah, all bad then. I, I owe you that third last time. This could be my make good. I don't know. I need you. You know those two bastards that buy stolen livestock. Sure, I know them. I don't like them. I'll give you 60% of the take. How many cows? I don't know, small herd, I guess. 20, maybe? 20, huh? Come on. <laughs> 60% of the profit? Come on, Where's Uncle. This ranch? Right in the middle of Scarlet Meadows. Just past the road's turn off. Lead the way. So how'd you find out about this place? I've been hanging around the saloon in Rhodes a bit. Rhodes? Yeah, the, the barkeep there gossips like a fishwife. And a couple of times he's mentioned how this rancher's a fall down drunk these days. Sounds like he don't know his ass from his armpit half the time. <laughs> you sure you ought to be hanging around the roads? Yeah. After everything that happened? What do you mean? I mean, that it ain't gonna do your health no good if they find out you ride with us. Nah, it's fine. I was never there at the same time as you boys. And they'd never reckon on a distinguished old fellow like me running with a bunch of reprobates. 
Well, just be careful. Yeah. Yep. How old are you, anyway? Well, let's just say I was born sometime between the fall of 49 and the fall of Rome. <laughs> and my second wife always used to describe me as ageless, though she did leave me for a younger man. No. Well, maybe we should cut you open and count the rings of whiskey. Now, I'm ready for my retirement, though. <laughs> Let me tell you. You've been pretty much retired <laughs> from the moment I met you. Now, yep. I mean the tropics, you know, the real deal. What the Dutch is talking about. That's why I jumped on this opportunity. The sooner we get enough money to leave, the better. Dancing girls with flowers in their hair, warm sand, cold beer. <laughs> That's how I'm going to see out my days. Well, I'll believe well, it when I see way. it. Let's get up there on foot from here. Don't want the horses clopping around outside the window. Oh, Come look on, at let's that. Take a closer look. My leg legendary animal is here. The the fox that I shot earlier. Legendary. Um, should I pick it up? No, maybe not. That's the legendary one. The hell? Who are these clowns? What? Where the hell are you going? I think I got a plan. Think? Hurry up! I'm yeah. doing the best I can, so shut up. <laughs> Hurry up and be quiet. You said he was a drunkard. You said that, that we could play the fiddle and we wouldn't wake him. I was talking in a metaphor. Now hurry up. Oh, what's a metaphor? You're a jackass. That's a metaphor. Well, you're a son of a bitch. That ain't one. Shit, you hear that? Get your gun out. Hear what? Oh, <laughs> Yeah, well, we yeah. ain't got time. You said he ain't gonna wake I'll up. Him we out. ain't seen him yet. Right up next to the house to keep him from running off on us. Come on. Go, go, go. Crack, cracker cow. What the, what the hell? I'm being robbed! Sorry. I need to eat something. Time. Whoa, whoa. Help me here, Uncle. Move out of my <laughs> way. You old yeah. coot. <laughs> what do you say? Whoa. Ah. Move it up. 
Just don't get stuck on the tracks. Then I'm gonna be really angry. Yeah, look at that. I think the game is helping you a lot, since I can't be this good at hurting. No, I, I can't be this good at hurting. Everyone is here. <clears throat> well, hey there. What you got? Cattle. Well, I can see that. Whose cattle? You're Doesn't matter. If the price is right. Well, I can give you uh, 50 bucks. Okay. 50 bucks each times uh, 20 cattle. No, no, 50 total. <laughs> this is old Squeer's cattle. He knows me. I can't do better than that. I'll have to move him right away. We'll take 200, friend. But I got costs. Mm. 150. 75 and not a dollar more. 100. And I don't shoot you. <laughs> so menacing. Clyde, pay your friend here. Mm. <sighs> Maybe I should shoot him anyway. Bye now. Be careful out there. This is nasty country. Hey, don't forget to put some in the pot. Oh, of course. <laughs> like I told you, easy. Sure, I guess. I'm headed home. You coming? Nah, I'll see you later. Thanks for the help with this, Arthur. Those bastards. Huh? Mission briefing? Nothing. So, I should really shoot these guys. They are ripping us off. Okay, my girl. Let's go to... What's this? Oh, Henry Lumiere. Oh, Jim Boy Calloway. I need to do this one. Mm, now I'm just gonna do Jim Boy Calloway. Can't get involved. Who's this? Yep. Whoa, no, mighty late for a social call. Get out of my sight. Okay. I'll break your Did he say city folks? <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm definitely not city folks, so... Oh, the last episode? Wasn't that when I found uh, a gold bar hidden in the rocks right outside there, roads? That was legendary.
So let's go to Jim Boy Callaway. Jim Boy, I'm coming for ya. I got all the photos of your fallen gunslinger friends. Farmhouse seems awfully nice. So maybe this episode will be a lot of running around as well. I'm sorry, but in this game there is a lot of running around. Mm. And it's always, I mean, it's always beautiful. Wherever you run around in this game, it's always so beautiful. So I don't mind doing it, actually. Oh! Hey, Mister, can you help me? Please help me. Oh, your my horse is. That on me and my legs are hurting, and I need to get home. Okay. Be happy to. Get on. Oh, you kind, Mister. If he your horse so died. To take me to That's where I'm from. That's where my people is from. Whoa, Lagrasse, sure, that's... that's don't normally trust no outside man. No offense, mister. Just don't trust them much. Right, all right, ma'am. I don't trust them much either. You seem like a horse rider? Yeah, your whole life, I bet. Horse don't help much in Lagrasse. What? Need a horse can swim fine as a duck be much more used to us. Last horse we bugged, got his foot stuck in the mud, get a came and ripped his leg off. Whoa, oh, she's talking. In the water. Another gator came and took the other uh, leg. Oh, no, what? And is no word alive. Jeez. You sure it's the horse's problem? Maybe you should be worrying about the gators. Uh -oh. Where was it? Lagra? Well, that's not like this. What, hmm. without the subtitles? Bet you travel a lot. You a fool. Can't find yourself no home to live and grow and die and if you always moving. Can't huh? build no roots down. Can't grow nothing up. Always moving is no good. Maybe I don't want roots. How about that? I'm not looking to settle. You think when was the last time you spent the week in the same bed? How long ago was that? I asked you. But it was a long time. No offense. But I bet it's been a long time for you. We getting close. Don't die or not. Huh? Without the subtitles, I would have had a hard time uh, keeping up with what she's saying. But okay, I think it was a good conversation. She thinks I should have roots. Okay, here's good. Thank you, Mr. Please. Let me give you this on account of you being so kind. I've got some jewelry. Oh, silver and Hope black. I never have to be on that horse again. Dang animals. Yeah, okay, but horses are good for traveling. Yeah. Oh, although your, your horse died. Oh, come on. It's so dark out here. It's so dark. Hey. Hello. Hey there, mister. Whew. This this was scary. And at the same time you know about the night folks, the night people. It's all right. Can't cut off Change my mind. <laughs> So, it's in the middle of the night. Hey there. Maybe I should do this uh, Henry Lemire when I'm... Because I, I think you can only do it during the night. Oh, I can't find my way here. 
should park here. Okay. Get up in here, your garden. Hello there, mister. Yes? Uh, I'm, uh, uh, sorry. I'm looking for, um, the mayor. Yes, please. Mr. Kilgore, or what was it? Um, I forget. Quite. <laughs> Welcome to government. Democracy. I forget. <laughs> An interesting idea. Monsieur Le Mieux? Le Mieux. Oh, hello, friend. Hello. Tacitus Kilgore. Oh, really? <laughs> okay. Now, you are not going to rob me again, are you? No. I... I'm sorry. Uh... Don't worry about it. But you are not a very popular man. There's all kinds of nasty people want to speak to you, Mr. Tacitus. I know. They won't hear anything about you from me. But? Oh, yeah, there's always a but. Of course, I'm a politician. Who needs killing? Nobody. We're not savages, merely Frenchmen. Don't be ridiculous, killing? Oh, dear. Terrifying, yes. I suppose I can do that almost mm. as well as kill. I'm sure you can. Now, it's all very ethical. You see, I've been trying to open a major museum, a place of culture to elevate people's souls. Yes. And what do museums need? Uh, art. <laughs> and how do you buy art? I don't know. I buy <laughs> art of some nasty little man from Paris selling me some destitute aristocrat's collection of old masters that it turns out he may have been painting himself. Ouch. Ouch indeed. But these are good paintings. I can't make the difference. And I'm French. Only this even nastier little man from New Haven has come here to verify my paintings, and he's saying that they're all fake. So? So perhaps he can be persuaded to revise his opinion. Oh, he's been okay. so beastly. Exactly. Now, Jean-Marc, <clears throat> perhaps you can take Mr. Arthur, oh, I mean Mr. Tacitus, to meet a little Professor Shitface and have a word with him. He knows my name. Saint-Denis welcomes you like a son, sir. Bonne chance. Come, sir, if you don't mind. The gallery is just at the end of this avenue. Okay. Uh, as I said, he is a beastly man, this professor. Believe me, friend, you ain't seen beastly yet. Not even close. You know, I thought we French had a monopoly on arrogance, but no. An overeducated American can be far, far worse. Well, luckily, there ain't too many overeducated Americans around. Yes, indeed. The mayor had such grand plans for our city, and it's... Come on. We shall have truly broad democracy. Working for the rich and the poor alike. It would be a travesty for this one man's You're so opinion. slow. <laughs> Put that into jeopardy. Opinions can change. Can they not? Oh, yes, they of course. All the time. Go to the right up here. The gallery is just up ahead. Whoa. There, Mr. Arthur. There. No. Oh. What's his name again? Officer Shift Taker. Shift Taker. Okay, secluded area. Morning to you, sir. Morning. Oh, horsey. Come on. Uh, uh. Hello there. 
Excuse me. Oh. Hello? The mayor asked me to get a preview of your findings in there. The mayor knows very well what I've found. Every painting was a brazen fraud. <laughs> that's a big claim. One that's gonna upset a lot of people. Myself included. I'm afraid that's just hard cheese. <laughs> now, I've got a train to catch back to New Haven. Hold on. I see it's gonna take a fist in your face to persuade you. Oh. Oh, wait. Wait. I gotta punch you to change your mind. I, I couldn't. My reputation. Oh. Oh. <laughs> How about your reputation now? I I'd never be published again. Oh. Damn. Now, okay, I I need to beat him more. You see, professor, an academic reputation is really far less. Than <laughs> oh no! Life. Yes, sir. I, I, I see uh, that now. The thing is, now people are gonna look at those paintings and love them. So you're helping me, really. I, you know I'm right, professor. Please, not get me upset with you no, again. No, 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 sir. You're right. You're very, very right. So you're gonna send the mayor what he needs. Um. Because otherwise, I'll be in New Haven. No, no. We don't want that. Of course uh, we I'll don't. I'll write my paper this evening, sir. Very good, professor. Very good. Yeah. Horsey, why did you follow me all this way? That was not needed. Hello there. What's his name? John Mark? So, turns out all those pains were real after <sighs> all. Problem solved. Wonderful, wonderful. The mayor shall be so pleased. Sure. Was uh, Professor Shiftaker happy to change his mind? He wasn't initially, but uh, he came around in the end. Oh, my lord. This is not right. Trust me, I've done much worse. We shall burn in hell for this. Here's open. Yeah. Here. The mayor asked me to give you this. Oh, thank you. You asked me to do it. And now you say it's wrong? Come on. Of course you knew he was gonna get beaten. That's so silly. Good morning, sir. Oh, what's this? Oh, it's the fine arts. Right? Come on out! You coward! We gonna talk about what you done to my wife! You're a dead man! There we go. I don't quite know why I did that. Because barbarity is boring, no? It kept me amused some years. You must go, my friend, before the gendarmerie arrive. Hey, are you gonna do right by this fella's wife? You have done right by her. The little bird is free. Hmm. I am an artist, cowboy. I must do what I feel. Look, I have an exhibit at the gallery. You come, see what I mean. Okay. He had a nice gun. That was the... No. No, it was a cattleman. It was a regular gun. Like my hero gun. This hero gun. Yeah. It's so beautiful. And now I can go visit Jim Boy Callaway. Come on, horsey. Follow me. I'm faster than you. <laughs> ah! <laughs> okay, I'm not. Sorry, I'm in a hurry. 
or something like it. Good morning to you, sir. Good morning. Okay, let's see if we can meet. I'm not sure I should be saying this, but I did hear that this black hair was one of the prisoners. Jim bought Callaway. Bibbidi boppity. You all right there? This is the famous Grand Corrigan. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm looking for Boyd Calloway and the man writing a book about him. This the riverboat they're staying on? Yes, sir, they're here. Around this time, Mr. Calloway usually enjoying a drink on the observation deck. You, you can follow me. If you're quick, you might catch him sober. Huh. Don't think so. Oh, my friend with no name. You found us. Sure. How did you get on? About how you'd expect. Well, any good anecdotes? Anecdotes? From the old days. Well, uh, to be honest, things went a little differently. Uh, I did shoot a lot of people. I, I thought that's sort of what you wanted. Well, I'd, uh, <clears throat> yes, that'll be fine. Do you think anyone noticed it was you? Noticed? I think the people I shot noticed. <laughs> I mean, do you think anyone would mind if I, if we said he'd done it? Boy Calloway. Sure, I don't care. Just as long as I share the money, of course I will. <laughs> Literature is a filthy business, but sometimes it pays well, especially when you lie. Great. That's a goddamn fast. What the hell's going on here? Uh, nothing. Who's this grass snake? Uh, grass you know, snake? I don't know. Have you been being me? I'm nobody, buddy. But I'm somebody. <laughs> and I can't have any nobody being this somebody, you goddamn. I don't know what the goddamn you are, but trust me, it ain't nothing I want to be, so you can't be me. What a way with words. Uh, damn you, Theodore Levin. You're a snake. Damn you. Hey, damn you, nobody. Hey, I'm already damned. Oh, I'm nobody, but buddy. I can't take credit for that, which I... Damn says I didn't. I, I'm an old man. This never happened to Achilles, to Gawain, to Caesar. It can't happen to me. I'm gonna kill them both here. Yeah, calm down. I'm a legend! <laughs> yes, you are. Uh, all, right, all right, well, let's prove it one more time. I don't have to prove nothing to you, nobody. No, of course you don't. But maybe you need to prove something to you. <laughs> you got quite a way with the words. Uh, maybe you, Aim uh, that you should thing write my book and we should kill Plato here. Someone now, else. Let, let's not. Now, come on. Who shall we kill? I, you kill, I mean. Ah, damn. I slayed my dragons years ago. I'm a tired old man. Ah, uh, now you're drunk and you're bored yeah. and you're a mess. Well, I always hated Slim Grant. Oh, he killed my cousin. But that was years ago. Well, where's Slim Grant? Who's Slim Grant? This is him. An old friend of Mr. Calloway's. He ain't no friend of mine. He's state marshal now out of Annisburg. State Marshal? Make a damn cousin killer State Marshal, do they? All right, I'll go get him. Great. We'll wait for you at Brandywine Drop. All uh, right, just sober up and start practicing. Otherwise, this won't be a book. It'll be a memorial. Uh, whatever you say. <laughs> you know what? I kind of like that fella. Yeah. So, do I need to go there now? Uh, Jim Boy Calloway. Should I do it now? Maybe I meet the professor first. Morning, partner. Yeah. Howdy, partner. So let's go see the professor. <clears throat> so, yeah, this is a episode where I doodle around, but at least I get to do these uh, missions. Ah. I'm not a hater. I'm a racist. 
Hello. Oh. Hey. He's looking for Gavin. I don't think anyone's seen Gavin. Professor inside here. Oh, that's right. I was supposed to go to the police station. Ah. Good, morning, ah. Good morning. Wait a minute. I'll go out here and I'll save this game. Yes. There we go. 49.8. So welcome to our humble police house. Can I go in there? What can I do for you? <clears throat> Chief, I'm representing the inventor of a humane execution machine. An electric chair. And he uh wants to demonstrate his invention here. Ah. I'm familiar with the man and his work. Tell you what, I'll give you a permit. But it's going to cost you $100 in fees. No. I should negotiate. Okay. Well, the price Damn is fair. It. Here you go. And here, sir, is your permit. A pen and unusual formalities, of course, such as uh, finding a suitable candidate, for humane dispatcher? I'll tell that to the professor. Good luck. What brings you here, huh? Well, you good? Where, where can I find this uh, suitable experiment? Good morning, sir. Good morning. Okay, let's go to the professor. Do you have a problem with this? No. No problem. Let's go to the professor. Go to the professor. So much shit in the streets. Calma. That means Boy, calm mister. down, right? Hello there, mister. You trying to piss me off? <laughs> What's in your crawl, huh? You're trying to piss me off. Okay, professor. Ah, hello, friend. Hello, professor. Professor Andrew Bell the third. That's it. So. The chief says you can test out your machine, oh. pending the usual formalities. And what are they? Uh, finding a suitable uh, subject. Ah, funny you should mention. This fellow here, he seems sturdy enough, and he's guilty as sin. Wilson J. McDaniels, wanted for murder, bigamy, and immoral animal Be husbandry. Bigamy? The mind shudders. <laughs> Find him for me, and help me put him out of his misery. Huh. Okay. Grizzly border north Why, of the tracks. This is all coming together wonderfully. Above the Heartland Overflow. Okay. Wow. Never shall a man have been so humanely dispatched as this poor Let's go and have a look. Oh, I know this uh stranger. That's a very 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 tedious tedious uh, mission. Okay, so if I go up there, I, 
I can't do that one. Yeah, I, I'll do that one first. I think that's the better choice. And then I'll get the the criminal. Yes. Let's go. If we hurry it up, we can do both in this episode. And then I can do the mission with Dutch in the next episode. Episode 30, 34. And on the way, I can actually hunt. I can hunt a little bit. Not too much. I just need a uh, uh, perfect uh, beaver, beaver skin. Oh! I have miracle tonic. Friend, all right. You're gonna be no. okay. You're gonna help me? Uh, you gotta. Uh, I have you gotta. Miracle Tonic. Um, Come um, on. Please. I've been witness to stranger things. Okay, okay, okay. Go, 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 go. Do something. Yes, 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 yes. Uh, Just stay alive. Okay. Okay. Go, 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 go. Let's worry about your horse later. Yes, 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 yes. Take it easy. What have you done? Have you been fighting? Hold on a little longer, alright? Must stay awake. Yes, I think that's a good idea. Where... Where am I? Saint Denis? Don't you give up now? Oh, come on! I'm dying. Get out of the way! This is it! I'm gonna hurry here. Doing. I'm helping this fella. I can't feel it anymore. Stop. Yeah. All right, friend. All right, we're at the doctor. Is it a hunting accident or? This is it. Yeah. Oh, good God! Quickly, bring him in here. Shut the door in my face. That's how you do it. Right here. And sit him down in this chair. What happened? Just saw you fall out of the saddle. Don't worry, you're at the doctor. Thanks, friend. I appreciate it. The cameras. Sure. There's also the matter of my payment. But we'll deal with that later. All right, all right. The camera's going loss. crazy. This wound's badly infected. Ah! I'll save as much as I can, but I'll have to amputate. What? What did you say? Just try to breathe. Uh, I'll give you something for the pain. Oh. Uh, there you are. Then I'll knock him out for a while. You did a good thing bringing him here. But now I'd recommend moving along. <clears throat> Okay. You do not want to see this. No. Nope. I don't know why, why the camera stick is moving all the time when I'm standing still. During game. No, not not anymore. Only only when they're in in game videos. Yep. It seems like. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Let's go. Wow, sorry, sorry, sorry. Oh man, 
Hey, mister. Hey, partner. Hey, mister. Hey there. Hello. <laughs> hello, ma'am. Why, hello? I need to compensate for the bad behavior. Hey, partner. How do you do, sir? Hello. Oh. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> I pressed the wrong button. Damn you, horsey. That wasn't my intention. Oh, man. I should I shouldn't ride next to people and greet them. Then there will be trouble. Okay, now I can. Hello. Hey there, Mister. Yeah. I'll I'll leave your horse here. Five bucks. Damn you. That's so annoying. Let's go to Annisburg. <clears throat> Hello. There. Hello. Hey there. Maybe some biscuits? I need to go uh, past the swamp thingy so I can just shoot shoot a shoot a perfect beaver. Going this way. More, more people in trouble. I was done for there. Oh. 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 No worries. I had a bite of that plan over there. Hit my guts like a freight train. It's that little one over there with the pink flowers. I'd stay well clear of that if I was you. Okay. Yeah, I think you've sold me on that plan. Tell me about it. This one? Oleander. Yeah. So that's for poison arrows, maybe. Okay, I'll go and hunt some beaver. I already caught the the legendary one.
Hmm. No one here. Only there. I think my my left stick is broken in some way. It, he Arthur is turning. The camera is turning. Somewhat. <gasps> That's a perfect one. There we go. Let's swim. It goes faster. Can't get up here. Okay, there we go. So we stow it there, and then we go to Annisburg. That's the fastest way. So didn't I have a... No, uh, a map? Pressure map? Pressure maps. Poisonous trail. Yeah, that's right. This one. So I know where this is. Yep. It's yeah. up this way. Mm, maybe not that way. Hey, partner. This way. So that that part of the map. Yeah, it's up here. So here you can see the snake. And there is something in the middle here. see the next part oh yeah yeah so I can do this one as well I can get the treasure when when I'm done with uh, this mission in Annisburg whoa steep okay no worries I kind of like this uh, fishing port as well, Van Horn. This is a very depraved, dark and gloomy city where the fishing is long gone probably, houses been burning down and they just keep on going. <laughs> There's nothing to do. Shouldn't do that stranger mission now. Let's uh, go th through here. Keep on to to Annisburg. Yeah. 
I like Annisburg as well. It's a cool city. It's uh, based around the, uh, the coal mining. So it's all about the coal mining company. But yeah. I, I think I only got time to do this one mission and then we'll see what I will do in the next episode. Because now Where's the sheriff's office behind the train? Never listen to me. It's like talking to a goddamn wall. What do you want me to do? I don't want you to work in that mine no more, okay? Would you rather I go back to thieving? Hmm? I'm providing for my family. Well, you can't provide for us if you ain't got no lungs. And what if it caves in again? Well, I told you a hundred times you two already. All right. That's It'll quite get an better. Argument. Yeah, sure. And, and who's gonna? I'm not putting on a show for the whole town. Blast it! Is there a man in this town who ain't a moron? Whoa. That you idiot. Too all right. I love him That's and I hate an him. Argument. Every day, covered in soot, coughing half the night. <laughs> Okay. Does he really think Jameson or any of the others give a damn whether he lives or dies? No, they <laughs> they probably don't. You two all right? That's quite an <laughs> argument. <laughs> okay. He's going back to the mine. Yeah, he has to. Yeah, that's too bad. Those were the days where people had to work in the mines and they died from it. Coughing up their lungs. Lawman. You. I'm looking for Slim Grant, State Marshal. Heard you boys know where to find him. Oh, Mr. Marshall was here last week. I think he headed up to Beaver Hollow looking for some outlaws. Is he coming back? Sure, when he catches them fellers he's been after. Well, how long's he been gone? Well, a couple of days. Well, okay. You ain't gonna go look for him? If your boss's boss, who you all hated, went missing, possibly dead, at the hands of a bunch of violent wanted men, would you go looking for him? <laughs> Well, yeah, probably, because I'm a fool. Well, when he's dead, maybe I'll become marshal. I'll be a hero riding a horse okay. from town to town, mister. Think of that. <laughs> Good luck with those jokes. Think of that. <sighs> yeah, there's so, so many great characters in this game. It's, uh, it's so awesome. I love <laughs> I'm gonna be a hero going from town to town. Think of that. They're so great. So awesome. Oh, and this music? Come on. Let's get it on. This music is awesome. Boom, boom, boom. Dum, dum, dum. Dum, dum, dum. Let's go save uh, this Mr. Slim Pickety Jim boy. Bing it in over here. Okay, yeah. Let's see what weighs faster. Dum, 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 dum. Hi there. 
Dun, dun, dun. Dun 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 Okay. Maybe I'll run into these uh uh up there Mudbrook Mudbrook people. Those uh, inbred Inbred crazies. Maybe those are the one who caught him. Oh, over here. So let's see. Should I take some potions, maybe? This one, I want to go with this one, drink this one. And then I can go with... Yeah, I'll go with this one. My pimped out. Can I sneak up on them? No. There is... Uh, that's the one I'm going to save, right? Okay, so if I stand right... If I stand here, I can shoot. Okay. You made short work of them. <laughs> yeah, that's good. There were only four. Just a second. I'm gonna loot these fellers. I've been praying for someone like you to come, son. Yeah. I'm tied to this tree. Yes, 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 hold your horses. Gold pocket watch. I don't think I get any time to loot if, if I free you first so I wanted to get this done oh not much more hello Slim Grant. Dave Marshall Slim Grant <sighs> okay let's get you out of here yes Indeed, son. Uh, uh. Oh. I need a favor, Mr. Grant. It's nothing big. I'll explain. It. <laughs> oh no, we're going to this place now. Oh man. <laughs> On the way, you might as well relax. This is real peculiar. <laughs> I'm State Marshal, you know. Yeah, I know. Just sit tight. All will be revealed. Now, you gonna tell me what the hell is going on here? I was. Before you got so short. I don't like staying still too long. It makes me nervous. Okay, there are no witnesses. Let's go, girl. Son, what the hell are you up to? I'm taking you to see an old friend of yours. It's a reunion of sorts. Oh. Will you stop being so damn cryptic? I'm telling you all I can. It's a job. 
Someone wants to see you, taking you to them. What if I don't want to see them? Well, that's a good argument for keeping that rope around your wrist. <laughs> I'm a state marshal, and this is an abduction. Horseshit, I'm saving you. This is just a little a detour, detour on the <laughs> yeah. way to liberty. I will prosecute you for this, you insubordinate bastard. There oh. you go again, Mr. Grant. Ain't doing yourself no favors. No. What's your name, son? This is it. Down here. Oh, is this... Almost is that an epic... Marshal Grant. State what horse Marshall is that? Grant. Yeah, yeah. Andalusian. That was a fine looking horse. Oh yeah, that's over here. Okay. Oh boy. <laughs> so you got him. Yeah. I think so. Did you kill his cousin back in 82? <laughs> Whose cousin? My cousin. I never shot no one didn't deserve it. Uh, you shot Jed Calloway. And I told you then I'd shoot you too. And I would've, if you'd shown up. I was there. No, you oh. left town. You take that back. But I don't care now. It's nigh on 20 years ago. We're old men. We're lucky. Fight me. You're an old man. Come on, fight me. It's a bit late, isn't it? God damn you. Oh. That settles that then. Shut up. Yeah. Shut up in the goddamn back. When these things happen. God damn you, goddamn both of you! Well, now calm down. Who cares? You should have shot him 20 years ago. He's dead now. You are a sickness scum like you and you, Plato. Come on, draw! Why? I said draw, goddammit! No. Yes! Oh, man. <laughs> he was better than me. Okay, this time. I'm gonna get it this time. Let's see. <laughs> Shit! Shit, indeed. Still. At least now you got a end into your book. He's dead. Oh, don't you start now. Uh, no, I'm not starting. I'm... I'm happy. I'm free. I can finally go back to writing westerns instead of being in one. Yeah, he was pretty wild. And I know some wild people. He was certainly complicated. <laughs> I'm sorry I shot him. No, and you didn't shoot him. He did, in the back, after he mortally wounded Slim Grant, fair and square. Yes, that's it. Last of the oh. gunslingers. Well, more or less, I guess. There's more? Oh, well, there's always folk who shoot you in the back and, and rewrite history. <laughs> okay, well, hey, so... Where do I send the money? Send it to Tacitus Kill. I sh I shot him in the no, foot. That ain't my real name. And that became a victory. I don't know how I could win that fight with only shooting him in, in the foot. But hey, mission briefing. Okay, never mind. Okay, so you can actually win this battle by shooting him in the foot. So now, now you all learned something. 
and I need to pick up this uh, weapon, otherwise I'll... Uh, let's see, there we go. So now I have uh, Callaway's, Callaway, Callaway's revolver. And that's a pretty fine one. That's a beautiful one. Although... I don't like the gun model, how it is. It's like a uh, Dutch, Dutch weapon. So I don't really like that one. But yeah, it's okay. Yeah, so that will be it for this episode. I have to save now. And in the next episode we will do the professional mission, the uh, the mission uh, collecting the uh, the criminal, and then we will go and meet Dutch. So thanks for watching. Bye.